Hey, what's good out there, YouTube world? It's your boy Bob Gnarly back with a new how to do today. And today I got the Backwoods, the Honey Pack, not open so I can show y'all how to keep Backwoods fresh. Or how to keep them fresh, y'all should say. Um, this pack feels pretty fresh. I don't really know. We'll see when we open it up. But... <clears throat> I just want to give y'all a little tip, man, a little blunt guys tip of the day, blunt guys tip of the week, whatever you want to call it, um, <clears throat> on how to keep your backwoods fresh, or as fresh as possible. So, <clears throat> see the back has the open up shit. So we're going to go ahead and open those babies. So, mm, nice honey smell. Got the back open. Nice honey smell. You see the back? So, see the back where it's fresh in the pack. So, I'm gonna take out the wood. So, you get in a fresh pack, you would take out the wood. And if you watch the video below this, you see how to roll up a wood. So, you see that you gotta find the little endings and, and peel it off. So, that's what I'm gonna do right now. I just found that in and I'm gonna unravel that thing. Now, the trick is <clears throat> to keeping them fresh is most people would just throw this tobacco in the garbage or yeah, in the garbage or in the ash or whatever or weed tray, you know. So, what I do because, see the wood, nice leaf, because the tobacco holds moisture and it's soft. It's more fresh than the actual blunt or the actual cigar. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna break my guts down right in the back foot pack with the rest of the cigars, by the way. So as you can see, I'm just, I'm just crushing tobacco up. You know, you're gonna wanna pull it apart and not stick it back in there like in the shape of a fucking cigar. But I'm gonna wanna just crush it up. So throw that in there. I got something that fell right here where I'm at in my little chair, so I'ma just scoop that in the pack too. So the key is to get some of that on top, some of that mixed in there, even in the middle, maybe even the bottom, all around us. You can see what I did. I got the tobacco mixed in there. And another thing is, the pack tells you to flip it over twice, but a lot of people don't for freshness. So that's just something you gotta remember too. Once you get that tobacco off in there, just fold it twice. Make sure you fold it kinda at the top like that, so you have, have more room to flip it over one more fucking time. And do it very tight without touching a cigar. So you get to flap it twice, I can feel a cigar right under it, but it's flapped. I may be even, even if you can get it curled over a little more, like a third time, like keep it as fresh as possible. So that was the tip of the day with your boy, Bob Gnarly, man. Blunt Guys TV, subscribe for more, man. We will be bringing y'all more shit. Shout out to Droopy the Don. And this was a Blunt Guys tip of the week, 1000. Shout out to everybody rocking with me. Blunt Guys TV.